Come all ye sons of Aaron, attention now I crave. While I relate the praises of an Irish hero brave. Concerning a great fight me boys all on the other day. Between a Russian sailor and a bold Jack Morrissey. It was in Terradelfiego in South America. The Russian challenge Morrissey and unto him did say. I hear you are a fighting man and wear a belt, I see. What do you say? Will you consent to have a round with me? Then up spoke bold Jack Morrissey with a heart so stout and true, saying, I am a gallant Irishman that never was subdued. Oh, I can wail a Yankee, a Saxon bull or bear, and in honor of old Paddy's land, I'll still those laurels wear. These words enraged the Russian upon that foreign land. To think that he would be put down by any Irish man. He says, you are too light for me, on that make no mistake. I would have you to resign the belt, or else your life I'll take. To fight upon the 10th of June, these heroes did agree. And thousands came from every part, the battle for to see. The English and the Russians, their hearts were filled with glee. They swore the Russian sailor boy would kill bold Morrissey. They both stripped off, stepped in the ring, most glorious to be seen. And Morrissey put on the belt bound with the shamrocks green. Full twenty thousand dollars, as you may plainly see, that was to be the champion's prize that gained the victory. They both shook hands, walked round the ring, commencing then to fight. It filled the Irish heart with joy for to behold the sight. The Russian he floored Morrissey up to the eleventh round. With English, Russian, and Saxon cheers, the valley did resound. A minute and a half our hero lay before he could rise. The word went all around the field, he's dead, were all their cries. But Morrissey raced manfully and rising from the ground. From that until the 20th, the Russian he put down. Up to the 37th round was fall and fall about, which made the burly sailor to keep a sharp lookout. The Russian called a second and asked for a glass of wine. Our Irish hero smiled and said, the battle will be mine. Ah, the 38th decided all the Russian felt the smart. When Morsi with a fearful blow, he struck him o'er the heart. A doctor he was called on to open up a vein. He said it was quite useless. He would never fight again. Our hero conquered Thompson, the Yankee clipper too. The Benicia boy and shepherd he nobly did subdue. So let us fill a flowing bowl and drink a health galore. To brave Jack Morrissey and Patty's evermore. To brave Jack Morrissey and Patty's evermore.